I love what I do. I'm on the road again. Ken, how, you know when they do like Tour de France, right? And then they interview them right after the race and the endorphins are flowing. Well, that's what you're witness to right now. Ken, I'm fucking buzzing, Ken. Would you not be willing to trade all the days from this day to that? Yeah! Just for one chance. One chance to tell our enemies! I just can't wait to get on the road again. You can take our lives! Yeah! Yes. But you'll never take our freedom! I love it. Oh, yeah. 89 mile in the wet, wet and windy, the fleece and gallery again. Fresh from the kill! Yeah! You're too shy, shy, hush, hush. I do I, you're too shy, shy, hush, hush. I do I. That that song came into my head this morning. It was quite, it was quite good, and I was, I was thinking, I was pondering myself, and I'm going, that's my fucking song. Because <laughs> Ken, I'm just like, um, you didn't want to be, uh, you didn't want to be the creepy, the creepy old man in the corner with a shifty eyes, you know, but. I wouldn't call it shifty eyes. I might like my eyes might look quite intense sometimes, but it's just like it's called focus. Ken, it's called focus. I can't even help if my eyes are intense the whole time because I'm just so fucking focused. Yeah, that's what it is. A bit of peace, love, and understanding. You know. No, I think the girls can them no creepy. You know what I mean? They can them no creepy. The Ken I'm just like wired. Ken I'm just wired all the time. I'm in the zone the whole time. I didn't even need the fucking music. I had the music today. It was just a bonus. But I didn't fucking need the didn't need the fucking music because I'm so motivated. I'm in the zone like Arnold Schwarzenegger every fucking day. I'm in the fucking zone every day just like Graham O'Brien, Chris Hoy, Arnold Schwarzenegger, and anybody else. I'm just in the fucking zone all the time. You can, yeah. I was saying to my brother the other day, right, I was going, right, Ken, everyone's, everyone's on a spectrum, right? Everyone's on a spectrum. Exercise intensity, that's on a spectrum, isn't it? So there's like, killing yourself for two minutes. Two minutes of killing yourself, which I did three days ago, right? And then there's like, that that puts into, into perspective. And you go, well, 90 mile done at an easy pace is fucking easy in comparison. There you go, <laughs> isn't that funny? Two minutes, balls deep. Killing yourself, right? Compared to 90 miles easy. It's like the ni 90 miles piece of piss. Because it's just, you're just, as I said to my brother, it's just like you're just plugging yourself like a, like a heroin addict. You're just plugging plugging yourself in your, into your little endorphin drip. It's easy. It's easy. Just like, right, I'll cycle 90 mile and I'll just plug myself into... About like ten volumes or something. So I'm 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 on now. It was wasn't it really wasn't it really uppers. It was like being it's like being constantly. It's like being on valleys or something, you know. So maybe in like an hour's time, we'll be like, ah, I just want to fall asleep, you know. They say apparently that's another thing. They say that the reason why uh, folk are addicted to cycling. This is the alternative. An alternative interview to the media, in it. You wouldn't say this to the media, would you? Oh yeah, I've just that's great. I love cycling, Ken. Why? Because oxytocin's released. You know, and what else is? What other activity is oxytocin released in? Yeah. So I'm just so in love with my bike, you know, da -dun -ksh, that kind of shit. So that's really quite nice. So 250 miles for the week. That's really fucking interesting, isn't it? Yeah! 290 mile, two, that last week, 250. Well, I got up to 350. Well, I got up to 350 next week. Yeah, take it to the limit, yeah. The 10 pound notes falling from the sky down onto my glistening, yeah, glistening, muscles soaked in sweat, like coming down from the sky like confetti, you can! Yeah! That's what it is, yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Uh, what else can I say? Any other any other points you'd like to make about the tell us about the bike run? Well, I it was good. I went through the wee valley through up to Grey Mare's Tail and kind of coming through a different direction, so it was really quite nice. And all the you know, like the looking at the the streams and the waters coming down the hill and the hang and then a bit like me kind of flowing into the stream and then kind of flowing and going with all that knowing and blah 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 there was a line of them coming my way up near the the Tala Reservoir, and uh, they were coming at me in a line. And one of them was on the right on the wrong side. The road nearly hit me. He didn't even know, he didn't even see me coming, so he, he swerved quite quickly to get out of the way. So there you go. That's about as much excitement has happened, and uh, and. Uh, you yeah, know, there you go, what can I say, do it all, enjoy it all, hashtag do it all, enjoy it all, like fucking Mike Tyson and fucking uh, Ken Dodd and Elvis and uh, what's his name? Oh, Schwarzenegger told you to do it, enjoy it all, do it all, Ken, try it, you know, kind of fake it till you make it, you know, tell yourself that you love it all. Oh, I, I, I love every minute of it, yeah, yeah. I wouldn't say that's quite the case, especially with this weather, but, you know, if you can motivate yourself to ride in conditions like this, say you're winning. We're winning every day, what can I say, yeah? Training like a fucking pro! No, like a pro. I am a fucking pro! Any fucking questions? Yeah, whatever, mate. Ta!